Hey guys, Breakman79 here with another episode of Let's Play um, Inventory Cleanup. I, I came here to the inn to sell off my goods and mm. identify stuff that I had gotten. Um, one of those was this mace, which I have given here to Minx. Um, forever hit a uh, target he hits, they have to make a save versus spell plus three or they're slowed which sounds like you know pretty nice um, I also upgraded him with um, a an axe plus three so now he has two of those so he can sit there and Swords, not words. You know, it's already equipped and go to town with his plus three axes also very nice um what else I am ready Mostly just selling, getting rid of, clearing out everyone's inventory. Well, some people's inventory. And I think that means we're ready for a new quest. Um, so let's open our quest log here and see what we got. Animal trouble in trades meet. This is like one of my oldest quests that we haven't done. Uh, so why don't we go do this one? Trades meet, huh? Okay, so we're going you must gather your out of the town. Venturing forth. Very well. So we're going to be heading towards the city gates, I guess. Let's get everyone together. Come on, stragglers. There we go. Whatever you want. Have a look at my wares. I trust oh. you'll find them all in Merchant. such Merchant, get condition. away, you. I won't pay. You'll pay. You will. Or yous get a face full of fist. That's pretty clear, isn't it? Bully all you want, but I don't have time for it. Leave. Leave me be. I ain't letting you go anywhere. You pay up or I starts to smash you. Da 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 da. <laughs> Fight! Kill him! Uh. Yin, you'll do nothing of the sort. Let him be. Huh? Who are you? Get lost. This doesn't matter to you, to you none. <laughs> right. It matters if you do it wrong. Go on, kill him. Oh, that's so terrible. Leave him alone, or I'm gonna beat the stuffing out of you. What? You don't need to be go threatening me. I wasn't gonna hurt him. I was just threatening. The guards won't care. They'll still still lock you up. These people here might even kill you for it. What? No. I didn't mean. I'm leaving. I don't want no trouble. Get lost, you gullywart. Everyone head out. Okay. Trades meet. Windspear Hills, Wild Forest. Let's go here first. You have been by Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bandit. Okay, not cool, not cool. How can I help? Didn't expect to be attacked right away. Um Yeah. What can I Let's see do? if we can get them off with this? Jeez. Mince and wool stand. Minx. I shall go forth at your command. Take care of the caster. Lost. Rats. Am I eating? All right, get the head. Ow. Please, let me help. Uh, uh. Ooh. Near death. Oh, he's casting something. Uh, maybe I can magic this one. Lightning bolt. 
lot more exciting. Okay, she's just wailing on them with uh, little rocks. Near death, injured, injured. Okay. Yeah, they they have no chance. Wop. Okay, let's see what the spoils of battle are. Mostly crap. A couple of. I'll pick up the spells anyway. Put them in my case. Oh, that sucks that I'm I didn't really get glad the stone to be of skin on. Hmm. Where am I? This was just some like random battle, wasn't it? If you say so. Oh yeah, they didn't make it there yet. All right, continue on your way, guys. Whoa! Again, not expecting to go straight into combat. What do we got here? Wild tiger, a spider, dire wolf. Okay. You need Naya, something? You... Yeah, you just stay right there. Just ask, and I'll do it. What's that? I think they're technically okay. Oh yeah, they're just chewing through them right now. <laughs> good day to you. Oh, good. Hold. Trades meet is not a safe area for visitors at the moment. Unless you have business, strangers, I suggest you return whence you came. <laughs> Wait a minute. What has occurred here? Why have all these animals been slaughtered? Okay, yes. I do have business. I have been told about these animal attacks and have been asked to help. Help would be a welcome relief at this point, although I am unsure what you can do to assist us. We fight against a revolt of nature herself in this place. But if you are serious, go ahead and enter the town. Seek out the home of the high merchant, Lord Logan Coprith. He can tell you more than I. But beware, strangers. The townsfolk are suspicious of outsiders. They blame druids for their miseries and see strangers as druid servants and spies. I myself am reserving judgment on that point, but I will take any help that we can get. I welcome you to trades me for what it's worth. Okay. Where can I be of most use? Always willing to try. I'm waiting. Of course. Okay, let's see. Take a look at the map. Oh, it's already filled out. Market. There's the mayor's house. The smithy. Trades meet crypt. And now it's raining. Have I mentioned how I love rain effects in games? Let's see what this guy has to say. May you know the happiness of a warm heart. You aren't working with the druids, are you? Oh, I know it sounds silly, but it's hard not to be fearful when the world has turned against us. Nothing useful. Heather, you selling anything? Not a friend. Hmm, I did not recognize ye. Ye be a stranger here, I think I... Then your dear daft come to a town reviled by nature, your accomplice, one of the two. <laughs> Either way, I've nae the goods to sell ye. I be a peddler without wares. Thanks to the damnable djinn that have set themselves up outside the city gates. <laughs> it be a sale you're looking for. Go and speak to him, otherwise be gone from his sight. Maybe we should just stop with the accents. <laughs> The correct way to approach life is to accept its travails. 
One must bend as the willow and see the obstacles that the gods place in front of you as challenges to be overcome. Hmm. Don't be moronic. You must struggle. Through struggle we grow stronger. Only the strong survive. And I am not your brother. Mm hmm. Strength comes through wisdom and pliance. One must be flexible to accept the things that come. Struggle only brings futility, my son. Struggle and adversity bring strength, not futility. War and violence weed out the weak and unhealthy. Strengthening all. And I am not your son. War and violence are the recourse of the weak-minded, my friend. When they occur, it is a result of failure rather than success. Bah. Let me show you what comes out of that philosophy, friend. Huntley. Yeah, boss? Show him what becomes of his philosophy. Right, boss. I hope you know I'm only being proven correct here. He attacks? Such a display of wrongness fills even Boo with disgust. For my hamster, I must land a blow for goodness. Be gone, commoner. I have my own business to attend to. And they to. beat him to death. Wow. Wow. <laughs> well, now I suppose you were right. After all, dead right. Ha ha ha. But I get the last word. Come, Huntley. Let's go. Minx's Kelemins. Oh. Yeah. Wallace, what do you have to say about this? Alas, my friend, I'm afraid I have no wares to show you. The cursed genies have taken over all of Trade Meat's mercantile enterprises. Mercantile, yes. Perhaps another time. Merchant? Boy. Little girl. What else is up here? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Dire wolf. Crunch. And he's dead. No, no. Anything to thank me for that? Mm, whatever you Eddie, decide. citizen. I used to hunt some of the forest animals when I was younger. I I wonder if that's why they're attacking us, getting revenge and the like. Declare yourself. Uh. Uh oh. You're not from here, are you? You'd best be careful, then, my lady. We've already arrested one druid for being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I'm sure you don't want to be the next one, I. I'm waiting up to it. Mad cow. Yeah, very well. Roddy? Ah, it's a fine enough day, isn't it? You know, I used to be a ranger myself. Mm. I know why it, it is all these animals are turning on us, I do. And why would that be? It's it's the gods. They've turned on us all. We've done wrong here in Trades Me. Trade Me. We're supposed to be fair and all. Joaquin herself commanded it. Ooh? But now Joaquin's gone, and everyone thinks they means they can go ahead and cheat you. Nothing here but cheats, thieves, and liars now. Yep. What does that have to do with you being a ranger? Hmm. Nothing. Just wanted you to know that I was a good person before I fell and all. But I was cheated right here, which is worse. But it's all ending now. Hmm. 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 You don't know what the hell you're talking about. It won't end if I have anything to say about it. Hmm. You can't stop the gods. 
trade meet going to the abyss and a hand basket. And that's all I got to say. Mm, tell me all we shall that. see about that. Peasant? Whose house is this? Okay, the mayor. Let us go speak to the mayor. Hmm. Nice place you got here, mayor. Guild Mistress Busa. You are a stranger to this town, are you not? I'm surprised you are allowed to come within the walls. You will find yourself unwelcome here. And indeed, if you came to trade meat to take advantage of our excellent markets, then you have come in vain. Between the druids and other problems, there is nothing to purchase here. Okay, what are the problems? Yeah, but we know what they are. It is nothing you need to concern yourself with, stranger. It is enough to say that our town is in danger of collapsing. There is nothing here for you to purchase. Nothing to purchase? You mean you won't sell to me? No. I mean there's nothing for you to buy. At least not from the merchants and peddlers that have traditionally sold things here in trade meat. If you are truly desperate, you can go to the Dao Jin that have set up their tents outside the main gates. Hmm. Their prices are exorbitant. Exorbitant. But they own everything there is to sell. The caravans will not come because of the danger, and the few that have come only do so at the behest of the vast amounts of gold that the Dao seem to have flowing from their pockets. Just who are you anyway? My name is Busa, and I am mistress to the Merchant Guild and Trade Meat. Once we promoted fair and honest trade here, but of late my title is rather meaningless. Okay, I shall be on my way. As you wish, stranger. Where's the mayor? Ooh, ah. Maybe if I talk to the guard. Declare yourself! If you are here to see Lord Logan, he is within his office at the moment. He does not turn away those without appointments, so you may go in and speak to him if you wish. Sounds great. Let's knock and enter. Hello. Lord Logan, High Mighty Merchant Logan. Myra, get down the business. Greetings once again. Hail, good people. I welcome you to trade meat. Mind not the worried stare of our citizens while you are here. Strangers are not easily trusted these days. Yours is a decent face, however, and I bear you no ill will. My name is Lord Logan Copperth. And I am the high merchant of this place. Hmm. May I ask why you're a high merchant? You look more used to armor than finances. Uh, why not? Let's ask this. I spent much of my career in the military, but other duties called me here. My family was influential and it fell to them to provide a mayor for trade meat. Perhaps finances are not my best skill, but the guard has benefited from my discipline, and I have improved security. There is only so much that can be done, however. Trade meat has been here for generations, but now we are harassed from the strangest of sources. It has been a very difficult time for the local merchants. The very land is against us. Animals attack and even the foliage strangles. It began subtly, but now we suspect a dark mind behind it. Until recently, we did not know where to place blame, but now the people have found a target. The last group attacked saw several figures directing the chaos. Druids, belonging to, belonging to a group that has long been peaceful. The people apparently captured one, had I not locked him up, they would have quartered him in the street. 
What is wrong? You have escaped scope. Torture him until the incident stops. And has he confessed, or have the people condemned him for being a druid? Yes. That is my dilemma. He claims he is here to investigate the druids, and I believe him. Unfortunately, many of our citizens already believe, believe him guilty. Nothing less than a public burning will satisfy an angry mob. This druid remains behind bars as much for his own protection as anything else. What I would have you do is escort him to his task, or see to it yourselves, whichever you prefer. I would seem to be collaborating if my men or I w were to help him, and alone he may not make it out of town. Will you help? Oh man, challenged by the town folks? No problem, we'll chop their heads off. I will decide only when I have spoken with this man. <laughs> ah, the money question. Uh-huh. Yeah, you know, I'm the helpful type. Might as well. So let's speak with him. I thank you. I will allow you to pass, so you may speak with him. He may leave under promise of your care. Keep me apprised of the situation. Okay. And where is he? In here? Nope, that looks like his bed. Nothing in there. Uh, what about downstairs? Let's just save it. Well, this definitely looks like a dungeon. Very well. Ooh. Surrend. Let's see, are you the one I'm supposed to talk to? Hello, and well met to you. I am Cerned. Oh, Cerned. Though my identity is surely no secret after the fuss I have caused here. You look pleasant enough. Are you friends of the charming Lord Copperith? I've made very few friends among the merchants. Hmm. I am indifferent about you. Once you're out of town, you're on your own. Copperith sent me, but I don't trust you. What exactly are you trying to do here? Huh. To trust or not to trust? That is the question. Uh, Cause he could be good or let's just let's lend a helping hand for now. Let's see what happens. He seemed less prone to rash action. Though the merchants had little reason to trust me, I arrived not long after an attack, so it must have seemed suspicious. I should have crept quietly as the vine instead of blustering as the wind. On occasion, I forget the subtleties that allow nature to progress. Ah, the blight shall pass, and I will return to cultivate better relations when the time is right. What has poisoned their opinions? Their leader is sensible enough. I am not quite sure, but I have suspicions. I will try to tell you what I know of this. I am CERN, as I said, sent from the north to investigate why the druid order of this region has severed its tithes with the traditional hierarchy. It is not unheard of. But the attacks have me worried. It can only lead to greater evils. These people will eventually strike out as an animal cornered. Yes, I see you have a druid with you. Jahira, is it? 
she will also be concerned, for she will know the danger of balance lost. I know many druids in this region, and they would not support such, such actions without due cause. I suspect that there has been a change in leadership here. It is my... Oh, it is the duty of any druid to find their new leader and ascertain if this is the best of nature. The attacks on the merchants only serve to alarm me. I might succeed alone, but I would much rather have the backing of a group, one that will also benefit from my service. Are you up for the task? Join me. Ah, okay, he's another potential uh, companion. Uh, I will help as best I can, but I do not wish any more for traveling companions. Maybe I should just at least take a look and see what he is. What does he bring to the table? Okay. We must go to the Druid Grove and investigate. Though I wish circumstances were better, every Druid goes eventually. Some challenge the great Druid status. But I fear that we will find this time... Oh no, I fear what we will find this time. I will indicate it on your map. We had best make haste, lest the nuts fall and grow before we even shake the tree. Uh, da, 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 da. Yep, we're gonna rescue our friend, who at this very moment her name escapes me. I uh, yeah. whatever, my friend. Yes, my friend. Then you will need my help. If you aid me in completing the quest I have begun. I have no qualms about aiding you and yours. It might be an exciting diversion. Okay. Let's remove Minx for the moment. Okay. Boo needs to know. Did you want us to remain with the group? Not at this moment. No, do not go to the Copper Cornet. Just wait right here. Okay. I am here to serve. And he has a magical stick. Staff, huh? Staff of the High Forest. Regenerate one hit point every two rounds. Hmm. Wait, is that... Aww. Right. I guess they thought about that in this game, that you can't just swipe their uh, weapons and give them to other characters and then dump them. Oh, he can't even take his cloak. Uh, terrible. Well, of course, he doesn't really have anything either. Um, what are you? human true neutral he is a shapeshifter interesting dagger quarterstaff sling scimitar mm, I wouldn't really call that really good right now hmm bonus priest spells Yeah, it's just like... Although, he does have a lot more of them. I'll say, look at that. Huh. Wow. Shapeshifter. shifter. 
Interesting. Well, good to know. Um, Minx, where did you go? I'm waiting. What where goes the stench of evil? So goes the cleansing wind of Minsk yep. and Boo. Okay. I question the throwing away of the apple while it is still green. But this is your group to lead. I will await you near the grove. Do not be long. Okay. Yeah. Fine by if me. You say so. What else is in here? Nothing in there. Huh, the table here has something. <laughs> They're all getting stuck. Ooh, a gem. I'll take it. Hmm. Alright, back course. upstairs, guys. You must gather your party before venturing Come on. forth. If that's what you want. Alright. So we need to go to his grove. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Whatever you decide. So I could... Uh-huh, uh-huh. Here we go. Mm. Fears that our situation may degrade in a war between the town and nature. Travel to Druid Grove south of Trade Meet and investigate. Okay. Now I wonder if there's something... There was a smithy in here. I wonder if he's got some... Uh, what? We oh. only seek to know if you have truly fallen away. You risk injury if you come any closer, my misguided friend. Oh. You have forced my hand. Ooh. Well, he just knocked the snot out of them. I have more important business than this. Sun Soul Monk. Ah, my head. What just happened here? I'll just say, are you alright? I'll be fine. No thanks to that traitor of Assad. The one you fought. Rasad in Bashir. He was one of our order, but no longer. Hmm. <laughs> What happened? We are members of the Sun Soul Order, worshippers of the Moon Maiden, Salune, or something like that. Uh, go on. Recently, a new cult has broken off from our rivals within the Order of the Dark Moon, led by named Collus Darathon. He preaches the Dark Moon heresy that our mistress. Saloon and Shar of the Dark Moon are two aspects of the same goddess. Uh, yeah, okay. Interesting notion. An interesting notion and a dangerous one. Followers of both Shar and the Shadows and the Moon Maiden Saloon flock to his false religion. Uh, uh, uh. Perhaps this new twin goddess offers something Shar and Saloon can't. Many will choose a comfortable lie to an unpleasant truth, but the truth remains unchanged. That might satisfy one who believes they have all the answers. It's a different story for one who has only questions. <laughs> Saloon has the answers to all questions for those who are willing to hear them. <laughs> she has answers to all questions as most gods do. Whether those answers are correct is another matter. Yet your friend has chosen heresy. I cannot explain what happened to Rasad, 
Those who are true to either Selun or Shar oppose Darathon. The followers of the Doc bleh, the followers of the Dark Moon have been ruthless in tracking down and killing all who believe the heresy. We gave Rasad a chance to explain himself. He will not make that mistake again. Hmm. Well, good luck. Excuse me. I am Rasad in Bashir. You seem familiar to me. He looks like one of the new characters. Huh? Of course we have, Rasad. Don't tell me you've forgotten our adventures along the Sword Coast so quickly. Okay. My name is Myra. We've not met, but I have seen you at work. Forgive me. I do not understand. Huh. A few minutes ago, I saw you lay a pair of Sun Soul monks low. I did not want to fight my brothers, but it was necessary. <laughs> Beat the nine hells out of your fellow monks? And also fun. <laughs> Let's see what he says to this. I had little choice. I can no longer trust my brothers in the Sun Soul Order. No, why not? A new cult has formed based on the Dark Moon heresy. That my moon goddess, Selune, and Shah, goddess of the night, are but facets of a single deity. Many in my sect find this idea appealing. Too many for me to risk revealing my secret to my brothers. I seek to join this new cult. <laughs> what? Your other cult? Sorry, your sect isn't doing it for you anymore? You've turned your back on Selun? I would never break my vows to the Moon Maiden. Okay. The Dark Moon heretics are led by a man calling himself Collis Dereth. Mm-hmm. I believe Collis Derethen is an alias of Alagor, the man who killed my brother Gamaz. Oh. That's a chicken of a different color. You can prove this. While tracking Alagor, I chanced upon a Dark Moon heretic. Rather than fight, I listened to what he had to say. And the more he said about Derethon, the more I became convinced he followed. Alagorth, right? Alor. Oh, these blasted names. Uh huh. So you have no evidence. Did you suggest as much to him? He didn't believe it. As a monk of the Dark Moon, he had met Alagorth. Cullis was a stranger to him. Still, I cannot convince myself the two are not at least connected, if not one and the same. Huh. I fear letting your desire to avenge your brother blind you to reality, Rasad. Is it really worth risking everything you believe in, everyone you've known and loved, on a hunch? Well, let's see what he says to this. I know only that I've come too far to stop now. Hmm, okay. Even if Darathon isn't Alagor, the heresy clearly threatens all who serve Seluni. And, and of course he just cut off there. It must be destroyed. Sounds good to me. It's been more than a month since I destroyed my last false cult. Join me. We'll take this one down together. Huh. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Um, let's just. I thank you. 
Together, we will destroy Alokon and his heresy. <laughs> I admire your optimism, Rasad. I'm not going to go too far with him. I just want to take a look. Okay. You know the drill? Minx. Oh. Who needs to know? Did you want us to remain no. with the group? Wait right here. So, what did the text say? I have reunited with an old friend, the Sun Soul Monk Rasad Bashir. Mm hmm. Good to see him again. What can I do? Well, let's take a look. Okay, he's a monk, so he has no weapons. Hmm, some boots. Some. Uh huh. Really? He has no. Wow. Ability bonuses minus six to his armor class. Wow. 3 to 14 damage with no weapon. Base attack of 8. Interesting. Human lawful good. He can use weapons. Hmm. Does he know any... No, I didn't think so. Interesting. Um, where is he? Okay. Where goes the stench of evil? Yes. So goes the cleansing wind Come on, of Minsk man. and Boo. Yes. Is this truly how things will end between us? I do not wish for our adventures together to end. They so didn't even it start, buddy. I don't... Hmm. Wait for me here and I shall return. Okay. Yeah, very well. I mean, it might be many hours later, but I might return. Alright, smithy, smithy. Okay, right over here. Okay, don't steal Tell anything. Tell me all about it. Well, you look like the sort who has more than two gold pieces to rub together. Oh, he's got nothing. Well, that sucks. Nothing to it. Okay. Oh, can't save. I guess I need to go back to the, um... Huh. Come down here. Let's take a look and see what they've got in these tents here. Okay, we're missing two people. There's one of them. Oh, wow. He really took the long way around. Alright. Mm, very well. Okay. Caravan merchant. Caravan driver. Whatever you want. You'll find no better prices in arm. I guarantee it. 
Oh. Until those genies are gone, we merchants can't sell anything to the town. And the town's merchants won't have anything to sell anyone. And now, Rafi's broke. It's a terrible state. Until the genies are gone. But wait, are there basically like two quests going on right now? Huh. If you say so. Can I save now? There we go. Of course. Alright, let's see if we can head outside of town. Druid Grove. Whoa. Yes. Stone skin wore off. Yes. Not good. Alright, I need to rest. It would be good for you to watch your actions while in this wood. Whoa. Uh oh. I give you fair warning, interloper, that this area is under the protection of the druids of Tethir. And if you do not leave, you will face nature's wrath. This is not as it should be. What has changed here to cause this hostility? CERN said it has not always been like this. Or I could pay? You have spoken with CERN. I had hoped he or another would be sent to help. He serves the great druid in the north. He will know what to do with this Faldorn. She has seduced quite a few with her shadow druid wiles. Perhaps he could challenge her. She seems subject to the old w ways even as she poisons our intentions. I must go. I cannot be seen with outsiders. Be careful. You will find few people to help you. Yes? Okay. I'll help however I can. How can I help? Hmm. Okay. Am I needed? Let's go. Not improved invisibility. What can I do? Let's go regular invisibility. No, let's detect. No. There we go. I'll All certainly right. try. Let's go exploring. Uh -huh. oh, that looks like a troll to me. Just one of them, though. Shouldn't be a problem. Is there anything up here? Nope. Okay. What's down here? Ooh. Three trolls. An ice troll? No, four of them. Two ice trolls, two regular trolls. Some more stuff. Spiders. Ooh. Phase spiders. Giant spider. Sword spider. Oh, walk right past him. Whoa. More trolls. Entrance to Troll Mound. I kind of wish they would stay on the map so I could just look at it. Alright, well, let's 
let's just scroll over here. Now they will just run back. Top speed. Woo! Alright. Oh. Is there anything down here? It really seems like there should be, like, this troll is guarding something up here. But. I mean, we can just kill him anyway. I'm waiting. If that's what you want. All right. Oh. I'm ready, of course. Now I can save. Just ask. It's almost beneath me. Okay. Yeah. Let's see, strategy here. Uh, this is a lot more exciting than any circus. Okay, bark skin. Every hamster has you his day. Minx can cast something for once. He's never done it before. It is about time. She can go with iron skin. That's probably good enough. Hmm. Whatever you desire. All right, Mr. Troll. You can come over here. Faster than Chick. Take a fast pause. And armored, sharpened, and the rising troll. Everyone else can, you know, go to town on this guy. Oh, one of my weapons is fire on it. Yeah, awesome. Nice. And since I didn't see anything up there. Where can I be of most use? Is that all? I'd hope for more. she didn't participate in combat, she's still hidden. Alright, let's get down here. Yes. Hmm. You know, How can I help? I wonder if I can get a fireball off before they can see me. Am I needed? Let's just move I her do what I can. out of danger. All right. Wait a minute. Please, glad to be of assistance. Can they sneak through here? Yeah, that's where they're gonna come through. All right. You need something? So, like about here? Because as soon as I get within range, they're gonna hit, start attacking her. I think that's out of range. Let's try it. Interesting. That's pretty cool. I wonder if I could just gotten out of their visual range and they're probably gonna yes. attack now. Oh yeah. I'll do it. Hmm. Badly injured, sweet. Alright. Come down. Yeah. Say hello to our little friends here. Oh yes, you wanna run away? Uh. This nature the life she gave. Hey, hey, hey! At your order. Not a problem. Oh, did that? I'm waiting. 
I don't know where the other ones went. Very but... well. Oh! The fireball almost killed them. You wouldn't finish them off, buddies. Oh, they got back up. Oh, that's one dead. And another one. I'll help however I can. In Bearvan's name, it shall be done. I'm ready for any if only I could do as much for all in need of me. I try so hard. It's who's ready for next for death? Uh huh. Spiders, huh? Uh oh. Nature's servant awaits. How do you get up there? How do you get up there? Edder cap. Huh. Okay. Yes. What would you like? What can I do? We're gonna try that All same right. strategy again. Just ask, I will do what I can. I think that's out of range. This is a lot more exciting than any circus. Drop it right there. Where can I be of most use? And glad to be of back assistance. Off. Ooh. How can I help? Always All willing right. to try. Hmm? I'll do my best. Yep. Injured. Injured. Badly injured. What is that? A groundhog? Hmm. I'm waiting. Nature, take the life she gets with vengeance. Ooh, crunch. <laughs> Nature, take the life she gets. Uh oh, Minx got poisoned. I await your need. Great. I'm not comfortable wandering something? around in the if, dark. If you're sure. The shadows could hold anyone. Let's see if I've got some Anything. magic missiles for him. If I can hit him. Well, I hit him. Yes. <sighs> Am I needed? I'll certainly try. All right. Who's next? Oh. Ah ha ha! That's how you get up there. All right. He's slowly making his way down to face imminent death. Do you want me to hold your hand, buddy? Come on. Let me go with you. You're just gonna stand there. Hmm. Come on, crew, let's go get him. Injured. I'll help however I can. Well, think he'll like another uh, magic missile to the face? What can I faster than chick? Take a fast pause. Yeah. Polish him off, would you? <laughs> oh, that's Please, funny. Of course. Alright, so we got a tr Mr. Troll up here. We know there were some down here. Alright. Yes. Oh, we had a Tiger Cowrie Shell necklace. It is done. Okay. I'm right. Very well. This is a lot more exciting okay. than any circus. 
my last magic missile. I'll do it. Yeah. Be whatever you want. Yeah. See battle bo run bo run. There we go. I'm ready. He be dead. It's almost beneath me. All right, let's see if we can take care of these guys. Let's get her out of fireball range. Yeah, that looks good. Hmm, if you say so. Okay, let's get the finishing off squad ready. You need some. Must I? Yes, you must, Ari. Let's fireball them. That looks good. Incurious. Boom! You shall suffer my wrath. Let's see how much that do. Barely injured. Oh no! Did it say barely or badly? Barely. Badly. Injured. Injured. Well, let's guess it's not. A... You point. Minx? I punch. Okay. You know, I wonder. I wonder if this if this place was thin enough, like maybe only one could go through. I could actually block them with my invisible character. Oh, the bark skin wore off. However I can. I'm waiting. Yes, of course. Oh, she's stuck. Well. Ice damage. Okay, use your... Okay, there's... There we go. I am ready. Took a little bit of damage there. We can just buff that right out. Alright, I think that's good. Okay, so the map ends there. What can I do? Just ask is that all? Okay, I'd hope for more. Continue our s rake in order. What's behind this? Anything up here? Nope. Well. Ooh, a troll. Poor lonely troll. Oh. Mage. So, am I gonna have to fight these guys or are they friendly? Hmm. Shadow druids. Kylan Lynn. Here's where I shot that thing. Not really seeing anything around here. That's it, one lonely troll. I mean, we could go into this troll nest, if troll you mound. Them. Hmm, if that's what you want. Guys, go up here and just kill the other troll. Yeah. Whoa, he's fast. Nature. We'll take the hand of justice! That's not right! 
right. I am ready to uh, go behind for it. honor and glory. Ah. I'm waiting. Whatever you desire. All right. This is a lot faster than you take a fast group. pause. Okay, guys. Um, I think we're about out of time for this episode. So, I guess in the next one we're going to charge in here, maybe. Or I might go up there and see what the uh, druids are doing. Uh, but you'll have to find out then. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.